Got a bitch, she gon' kill for real. Talking about Clyde and Bunny. Cool with the kid, cop it. Got to pull up with a stick, stop it. Stop it. Rich nigga shit, Solid. Rich nigga, oh, honey, fuck his riding. Got it. I go to space with the stars. Star. I smoke a blunt on my pilot. Saturn moon, earth. Ah! Hey, y'all! Did y'all miss me? I apologize for being in my A. Your girl was too busy crossing those burning sands. Yeah, we're here now and let's just be grateful. I came back and I had 440 subscribers. I like that y'all stuck around in my time of need. I appreciate that. Today is currently 6.02, Thursday, July 29th. And I am getting ready for a six day long cruise. I will be going July 3rd through July 8th. And right now I have nothing ready. Like I'm still in my work clothes, my hair not done, my nails not done, my lashes not done, my wax not done. So this will be getting ready for it. This video is gonna be a little bit of a prep. Kind of like a get ready with me from a cruise. I really been struggling, like I really been going through it. My face is breaking out, nothing is ready, like <laughs> I feel like I gotta rush. I'm really scrambling around to get stuff done, and it's like I don't know. I have a lash appointment today at 7 p.m. And this girl has yet to send me the address. But I bet you if I show up at 7.30, she's going to try to charge me a late fee. That's dead. She got the right one. I promise you I won't. Oh, my gosh. Y'all want to go tell me my piercing was flipped? That's embarrassing. That's what we're going to be doing. I'm going to be just going day by day, slowly getting my appointments complete. So, today is my lash. Tomorrow, I'm getting my nails done. Saturday, I'm getting my hair done. And Sunday, I'm getting my wax done. So, Everything is all scheduled. Um, I still think a couple things I need to do, a couple running around I need to do. It's just a whole lot, like. Hey, y'all. Hey. Ah, y'all, she rescheduled my last appointment that I had today at seven o'clock. <laughs> y'all, why I'm here getting ready to go to my last appointment and this lady gonna tell me that she canceled and she wants to reschedule for tomorrow girl if i could have my appointment tomorrow i would have booked it for tomorrow this gonna make me mad because this that stuff we talk about you have one job if i had time to go to my appointment tomorrow i would have booked it for tomorrow i don't understand like what do you talk what is it with y'all? Y'all do this every time, but y'all prices be jacked up to the roof. And this is the kind of service we get. I'm not even going to be mad because I still need this lady to do my lashes. And she better eat. I'm not playing. My lashes better be cute. This lady did most definitely just reschedule my lash appointment. I guess I'm going to try to see if I can see her tomorrow, but I don't need everything to go right. Like, I don't need nobody playing with my time right now. This is not the time for that. Like, I, I'm sitting up here putting Vicks Vapor Rub on my pimples because why am I breaking out? A couple days before a cruise like this that stuff i be talking about i really do mean it when i say i have some type of bad luck like what what i did is this karma for something did i do something to somebody that's what it had to be because ain't no way so as of right now it's friday 7 41 a.m i have my nail appointment at 10 30 a.m not sure what set i'm gonna do yet i was trying to go for something a little bit more like summery springish very colorful very bright um but right now i'm torn between these two sets so what i'm probably gonna end up doing is just getting them combined yeah, i don't know if i should get pink pink ombre nails or if i should get orange ombre nails i'm really finna just show the lady the two nail sets and tell her just do something and make it cute um and then later on today i have my lash appointment which is at 4 p.m um which was supposed to happen yesterday but that's a whole nother story for a different day child i did text that lady and ask her like um is there some type of discount involved given the situation because you canceled on me but you want me to pay you full price no 
So, yes, this should be very fun, very interesting. Um, I'm excited. My last sister is going to pick me up at 10 a.m. Um, to take me to the my nail appointment. She, The girl has, like, nail school or something, so she's going to be like doing my nails as a demonstration for somebody else so that's gonna be real interesting so i know my nails gonna be cute because you don't want to mess up in front of nobody like that's embarrassing you don't want to do that so i know my nails gonna be cute she did tell me to soak my toenails off with they got acrylic on it but i don't know how to so i'm honestly just gonna pay the upcharge because i definitely still got acrylic on my toes but they they the chop shop acrylic nails and you know i want the nail tech acrylic nails you know what i'm saying it's a difference if you know you know but yeah um i will be back when it's time to go it's 9 30 y'all child let me get up and get myself together baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel like chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced I'm literally so sleepy like y'all don't understand I'm very sleepy the day before the cruise I'm gonna make sure I go to bed early all my people they gonna want to wake up at 8 a.m. every day cuz y'all know how black people is my last sister <clears throat> should be here shortly so yeah let's get it pop <laughs> Okay. Y'all, I finally made it to the nail salon. Um, she said she's gonna let me know when I can come inside. It's kind of hot, and she also said I can record. But yeah, I'm here. It's 10:17 a.m. I'm excited. Like, I just know she been eating. I just know she been eating. It is 3.32 p.m. I took me a power nap after I got back from getting my nails done. Y'all see them? Real cute. My Uber should be here in 8 minutes for me to go to my lash appointment at 4 p.m. But y'all, I'm low-key scared. Like, what if it's ugly? What I'm gonna do? I feel like all in all, it's gonna be real cute. The final product gonna be real cute. But yeah. to sleep for a quick little nap woke up it's 3 26 in the morning i have to be ready packed up and ready to go by 7 30 so my dad can get me at eight o'clock i still haven't took out my hair which is supposed to be done already so i'm probably gonna end up doing that in the car so as of right now i'm just gonna be cleaning up my room and just straightening up everything because i don't want to leave go on vacation for a week and my i come back and my room is filthy that will make me so mad like it's not that that's gonna make me mad 
Here's the nails. They real cute. I'm just mad because I think I got them too short. These give me medium vibes. Like, And just to clarify, it is not the nail tech's fault. She literally asked me what length I wanted them, and I told her this long, and I didn't realize until afterwards that it was too short. So, yeah, go book with her. They're supposed to be long. They're definitely giving me medium, and I'm more of an extendos kind of girl. So, yes, I would have liked them to get them a little bit longer, but I ain't tricking. Like, we're going to make do with what we got. But yeah, I'm just looking at these, and I'm like, these look short, but it's okay. I'm not tripping by it. I actually am a little bit. Like, I'm really upset. Like, I really wanted my nails to be long. I'm on vacation where I'm getting short nails. Child, the way the state of my room right now. It's crazy. Like, it's crazy. I don't even know if I'm going to record this part. It looks so bad. Like, that's, I'm, I've been going through it. Uh, why my dad called and said he was 30 minutes away? It's 7.36 a.m. I haven't finished packing at all. So, we're going to have to speed pack. And if I miss something, we're just going to have to go to Target. Because my dad don't like to wait for people. I should have packed yesterday. But, you see, I don't even got no excuse. I should have packed yesterday. Let me get to it. This is the way I look, y'all. Today is the day of my hair appointment. It's 10.40 a.m. right now. And my hair appointment is at 2.15 p.m. It's about 30 minutes away. I also have to stop to the hair store to pick up the hair. And I also need to wash and blow dry my hair. So, I'm kind of pressed for time. So, yeah, let's, yeah, let's get it. <laughs>
camera died in the middle of my hair appointment i took clips of it on my phone just so that y'all can see the process my new camera lens just came in the mail right now and uh, my new camera lens just came in and i'm gonna put it on and then i'm gonna show y'all my hair oh my god so do i just add it on top of this one Okay, cause yeah. Okay, cause yeah. Gosh, this makes such a difference. Oh my gosh. I could finally record and have my whole face in the camera. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I should have been bought this. Oh, y'all yeah, can't tell me nothing. Y'all can't tell me nothing. But anyways, let's get into the bulk of the video, like for real, for real. This is so much better. I should have been bought this. I feel like a real YouTuber now. Like today is Sunday, June the second. My cruise is tomorrow. As of right now, y'all see these eyebrows looking real, real rough. My next two appointments is to get my eyebrows done, and then I have my wax appointment, which will be around 4:30. The wax appointment is scheduled for six. PM and then I'm gonna get my eyebrows done at like 4:30 because the place closes at 5. Right now it's 12:01 PM. So yeah, um after that I think I'm gonna do a little bit of running around because I do need to get some things. <sighs> like for instance, somehow, some way I forgot to pack pajamas. So it's like what I'm gonna be sleeping in on this boat. Don't know. So now I gotta do some running around, pick up some last minute things, get some sunscreen, some little travel size bottles, all that good stuff. Cause yeah. But yeah, I never showed y'all my hair. Why did I forget that? Okay. She did so good, y'all. Oh, it's a little tight. Ooh. Ooh, it's still it's still a little bit tight. But yes, y'all look. Hold on, hold on. I gotta set y'all up. I gotta set y'all up. Oh, 
she ate down. Y'all, you ain't never seen braids this neat. Let me get some lip gloss, my lips chat. You ain't never seen no braids this neat, baby. Okay, okay. And I know y'all been seeing this style trending on TikTok. And I just thought it was the cutest thing ever, like. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Yes, she did so good, y'all. I wanna pay her again. Like, I wanna give her another deposit. Like, I don't know. I apologize I didn't show y'all it yesterday, but your girl was so tired. I was so tired. I went home and went straight to bed. Like, I was so tired. But yeah, y'all can't tell me nothing. When I get my eyebrows done, I'm really finna be that girl. Like, you really ain't gonna be able to talk to me. Cause what? Hey y'all, so we finna go get a wax and get our eyebrows threaded. <laughs> so we done finally made it to get my eyebrows threaded after almost crashing twice. Oh y'all, the last lounge. I think it's a lady outside waiting for us. Let me see my camera. Oh, you really want to get it ready? Yeah, just me. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Mona, she's ready. Yeah, she's with the first part over here. Okay. So, how you like your eyebrows? Your curly eyebrows? Uh, um. So, I just, I don't touch your length. Mm -hmm. So, I go here. Yeah. I, because you have no hair tag part. Mm -hmm. So, I leave the hair mm -hmm. to grow. Okay. Yeah. yeah There's this part. side. See, you have hair, but mm -hmm. this side you have no hair. This side is thinner, this is thicker. Okay, so let's see. This lady house. Right, here we go, y'all. After this lady done messed up my eyebrows. It don't even look the same, but it's okay. Meanwhile. <laughs> don't look, Raven, don't. Ooh, that burn. It's burned or you scared? I'm already above. <laughs> you ready? No, I'm not. <laughs> Alright, it was okay. I had a client yesterday standing up on the table, so. Standing up? Mm -hmm. She had, what? Yeah, she was standing up on the table. She's like, wait. I was like, listen, you can finish or you can go on home. It's up to you. So I'm not going to force you. <laughs> oh, it, it hurt, but not as bad as I thought. So, I get a pain like a six, seven out of ten. Because the way they made it sound on TikTok. I thought I was gonna be in there screaming and hollering. But it wasn't that bad. Yeah, my armpits, it did, it was like a four. Yeah, they said armpits don't hurt. Yeah, it wasn't. But I also already waxed my armpits at home. So yeah, we balled, kinda. I gotta get my legs next. She asked me if I'm gonna do the butt strip. I respectfully declined. I should've got it only cause it was included, but it's like, I don't need it. Who finna be in my booty? But we finna go eat. I think I want wings stop. We just talking five dollars. You can say five dollars left home. I ain't gonna wing stop. Which one? What's that place I just seen it? Darn. It's uh the wing spot. That's where we going. Oh, that place that Keithley reviewed? Yeah, no. Yeah. I thought he reviewed wing stop. 
No, it was this. He said it wasn't good. Yeah, we gonna go ahead and go to Wingstop. That one on Kirkman, she talking about them. They make the best do the best ones. So when you go to Wingstop, you gotta go to the most ghetto Wingstop. Hello. Hey, ma. Hi. Uh, we going to Wingstop. Is that okay? Yeah, you already got your appointment done. Yes, I'm finished. With the wax and the brows. Mhm. Mm Mama, oh, so the wax, the wax wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, but it still hurt. Yeah, yeah, I heard it hurt. And she, she was saying, um, cause normally I don't shave a lot unless I'm going to the pool. But normally when I do, I only get like the bikini line. Hmm. And she was telling me not to use a razor and not to use a uh, nair consistently like every two weeks. But I don't shave you like that. No, I wasn't. I only use, if I use nair, it's like once every other month. Oh, okay. And it'll only be on the outside. Got it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He fucking that shit up. Oh, God. So I finally made it home. That pretty much concludes the vacation maintenance vlog. I'm going to add up the total amount that I spent in the spring summer so that y'all know. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'm about to go record a vacation trial haul, so stay tuned for that video in the next. I'm gonna try to drop it 24 hours after this video, but I can't make no promises, okay? So just make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I will see you guys in the next video.